is this called post-pregnancy brain? I don't know, but I'm just so forgetful. I forget everything that I'm about to say. So yeah, yeah, great. So anyway, so I just want to make this quick little video to show you guys a great technique on how to use a Hakka pump. I've been using this Hakka pump for two-ish months now and I was just using it regularly as advertised and I saw this video of a great technique and I wanna show you and it makes such a huge difference. So to begin, I have this silicone <laughs> fake booby because I really want to demonstrate how to use a Hakka pump. This is my Hakka pump, right? So before I would just squeeze and it will suction my boob, just like that, just like that. Now, when I found this great technique, this is what you do, okay? I'm just set the boob in here. Actually, I have two boobs. I wish I had two Hakka pumps, but I only have one, but I have two boobs in here because it comes into a set. <laughs> Anyway, what you do is you go like this. I hope you guys can see that. You go like that and you take the boob. You kind of fold the top. So you go like this and you squeeze on the bottom and you let go and this suctions. See how much boob that's in there? How much suction and this it's not going anywhere. Unlike the traditional way of putting it on, I knock it over every single time. Sometimes Blake would kick it and it gets knocked off. But look at that. Look how tight that is. This is not, come oh, it came off. <laughs> but maybe because this is not a real, real boob. But anyway, this is the traditional, this is the traditional way of using it. And this is a great technique of using it. You fold the brim, you put it on your nipple, you suction on the bottom, and, and it just, why is it not working in this boob? It's me because it's a fake one, but I promise you, I assure you it works great on your boob. Let's do this again. You fold the brim, you put it on your nipple, you suction on the bottom, and voila, look how tight that is. Look how tight that is. Look how much boob that is inside. And I'll show you what it looks like with just the regular way of putting it on. So that's the great technique that I'm talking about, right? This is the other technique, just regular, that. And this can just come off super easily. So I just want to quickly show you that because I've been using the Hakka pump for the longest time. Well, not longest, two months. And then when I found that video, I'm like, oh my God, what? why didn't I see that sooner? But anyway, just thought I'd share that. And so, happy pumping, moms.